Hey guys, on today's video, we're gonna be adding one of these guys into your system. So let's say you guys already have one, you're adding another one, maybe another, 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 another one. So you guys did the main setup for your very first one. All we have to do is go back into your Google Home app in order to set this one up. So before we get into anything, let's just open that app up right now. So whether you guys did your main setup on an iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch, or maybe an Android, Samsung phone, it's the same thing. You guys have to all go into the same app, which is Google Home. So we're gonna open that up. So right now, here's my Google Home. It's detecting already the two speakers I already have. Those are Nest Minis. And we're gonna add one more into this. So let's just connect this up. And right now, just make sure you have your Bluetooth turned on, your Wi-Fi, everything, so we can sync this up. Adding a speaker into this, it's much easier than the initial setup. I do have a setup video if you guys are setting this up for the very first time. However, if you guys are just adding another one, that's this video. Because we are adding another Nest Mini or Google Home Hi. Mini into Hi, to our get mix. started, download the Google Home app on a phone or tablet. So we already did that. So on our app, we're gonna see setup device. That's very top right here. So let's just tap right there. So let's just select that or you guys can create another home at this point. Just go right into next. Then it's gonna look for your device. So just make sure this guy is close by so they do detect each other. Do not have whatever device you're setting this up on with airplane mode or anything like that. Turn on everything, including Bluetooth. Right now I can see my Nest Mini right here. So I'm just gonna tap on it. Then down here below, I'm gonna see Next. Now it's gonna connect to my Nest Mini. So if you guys heard that sound, then we just have to click on Next. From there, well, this is, you guys did the setup already, so you know what to do. However, yeah, I mean, and from here, we have to select the room that this is going to. I don't see the room that I want, so I can actually create a custom room. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna add a custom room, and I'm gonna name it Basement. So I'm gonna go Next. And right here, it's gonna be in the name. So I'm gonna tap on it, and I'm gonna call it Basement. I'm gonna hit on Next. then you should detect your Wi-Fi right away. Because you guys did this setup already with the very first one. So we're gonna go next. And like I mentioned, the setup for this secondary or third or fourth <laughs> Nest Mini or Google Home Mini, it's gonna be the exact same thing, just a little bit shorter than setting up in the initial one because we already have an account, we have all that set up. So I'm gonna stop touching it because I keep putting up and down the volume. From here, we're just gonna select next because it's Canada, sure. You guys can set it up as US or we can set it up to English US. It depends. We're just gonna leave it as US. It's gonna hit next and we're gonna activate this. So again, agree, agree. So your assistant should be able to recognize your voice already. And part of this setup will be actually updating. There's always updates that you have to install on the device itself. So right now we're just gonna tap on agree. Agree or next will always be down here on the bottom right hand corner. We're gonna tap on next. I'm gonna put not now for the radio calls. We're gonna say yeah. I'm gonna go and continue. And what we're gonna get is a review of everything that we have set up. From there we just have to click on next and it's gonna start installing updates. There's always updates that need to be installed Right now, your home mini, just make sure not to turn it off. Just let it be. It's gonna have these lights. That's perfect. It's supposed to do that. Just leave it alone. Do not disconnect it, especially when it's installing updates and uh, downloading as well. But uh, things can happen if you guys unhook it at this point. So just make sure to not unhook it from electricity. Once that's done, we should see this screen. Just select next. Next again, it's gonna tell you everything that you already know about your Nest or Google Home Mini. Hi, I'm your Google Assistant. I'm here to help. To learn a few things you can do, continue in the Google Home app. So right now we're pretty much done. We can be more, sure, why not? And we can finish setup. So right now, as you guys can see, I added basement. 
there's one in my bedroom. And then living room, I have several Google devices. So this is how to add one more Google device into your mix. This is normal. You're supposed to see them all right here. We can play music on any one of them. I can even tell this guy that's in the basement to play music upstairs in my bedroom or in the living room. So I can talk to them to play music anywhere that I want throughout the house. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.